definitions. Bharatanatyam has many technical terms which define its form. Adava The root of Adava is from a Dravidian term Adeva which means to step, to reach or to achieve. Today, Adava is considered as a basic dance unit. Each Adava has a posture, rhythmic movements of the feet and an accompanying hand gesture. Korvai A combination of Adavas made into sequence and ending with Thirmana Adava is called a Korvai. A Korvai is set for a chosen number of avartanams of a particular tala. Did you know, when weaving a silk sari, the contrast gold or silver jari border is interwoven with the body of the sari. This is known as a korvai border sari. Sollekattu Rhythmic syllables used for dance like ta, re, ke, ta are called solle. When these syllables are combined, they are known as sollukattu. For example, tarita, dhanata, jonutta. Jati A jati is a structured korve set to sollukattu in a chosen tala. The jati ends with a tirmana adava repeated thrice or in multiples of three, with its corresponding sollukattu. Nritta Nritta comprises of adavas done as korvai or jatis. Nritta is the rhythmic aspect of dance set to tala. It does not tell a story. Nritta need not communicate an idea. Its quality is to add beauty to dance. Did you know? The Alaripu and Jatiswaram are Nritta compositions. Nritya Nritya is expressive dance or simple communication. The Abhinaya, Hastas and facial expressions are used to convey the meaning of the Sahityam that is words. Did you know? We see elements of Nritya in compositions like the Shabdam and Kirtanam, Padam or Javali, Natya. Natya literally means drama. In addition to Nritta and Nritya, it includes characterization, dialogues and stage props. It uses all the four types of Abhinaya Angika, Vachika, Aharya and Sattvika. Did you know? Any dance drama such as Ramayana or Mahabharata done with relevant makeup, costumes, stage properties and settings is a good example of Natya.